Hello students in this session we will discuss the fundamentals of electricity by the end of this session you will be able to discuss basic electric fundamentals discuss different sources of electricity generation differentiate between conductors insulators and semiconductors electric fundamentals electricity is briefly defined as the flow of electric charge or electrons electrons are moving around the nucleus in orbits and carry a negative charge an equivalent number of electrons and protons are available in each atom the number of electrons and protons in the atom can determine the type of material and how electricity is conducted an atom has neutral charge because an atom consists equal number of negative charged electrons and positive charged protons in it conductors semiconductors and insulator conductors the materials that allow the flow of electrical current in one or more directions is known as a conductor a common electric conductor is a metal wire commonly used conductors include silver aluminum gold cast iron steel copper insulators it is a material whose interior electric charge doesn't flow easily and therefore makes it almost impossible to conduct an electric charge under the influence of an electric field examples of insulators include rubber nylon plastic porcelain fiberglass ceramic wood and ebonite semiconductors these are hard chemical element or compound which can conduct electricity under some specific situations this characteristic makes it an excellent source for the control of electrical current examples of semiconductor silicon carbon germanium how electrons move through a conductor a positive charge is located on one end of the conductor and a negative charge is placed on the opposite end of the conductor the following event occur if a source of power such as a battery is connected to the end of the conductor an imbalance of surplus electrons at one side of the circuit and a lack of electrons at the opposite side of the circuit is required for the flow of current the negative charge will repel the free electrons from the atom of the conductor whereas the positive charge on the opposite end of the conductor will attract electrons as a result of this attraction of opposite charges and repulsion of like charges electrons will flow through the conductor sources of electricity friction when different materials are rubbed together the friction generates and causes electrons to be transformed from one to the other heat thermoelectricity is defined as when pieces of two dissimilar metals are connected together at both ends and one junction is heated then the current permits through the metal light the light energy is shifted to the free electrons of the metal when certain metals are exposed to light this extra energy breaks the electron free from the metal surface chemical a change is produced in potential or voltage when two dissimilar materials usually metals placed in a conducting and reactive chemical solution it is the basis of automotive battery and this principle is called electrochemistry magnetism if a conductor is moved through a moving magnetic field or a magnetic field near a conductor electricity is created the session ends here 
let us have a quick recap before we proceed to the next topic after studying this unit the participants will be able to understand the electricity and how electricity is generated understanding of conductors insulators and semiconductors understanding of how a conductor conducts electricity know about different sources of electricity